Well, what else could I have done, Mama? I can't just overlook it. He has to learn to mind. That's very true, but without Uncle Remus and his stories, the child would be utterly desolate. He needs something to... Yes, sir, that's right. George W. Banks, 17 Cherry Tree Lane. About six foot one, I'd say, sir. Oh, yes, we rang up his bank first thing this morning. The only thing we discovered was he'd been discharged last night. No telling what he might do in a fit of despondency. It wouldn't hurt to have them drag the river. There's a nice spot there by Southwark Bridge, popular with jumpers. Really, Ellen? Hold on to me. Well, he has his mother and his grandmother. We're not enough, Sally. The boy must have friends. And if it's not Uncle Remus or the Favors children, then it must be someone else, someone of his own age. That's just good common sense. He seemed to have been a fine stable gentleman, sir. No anky panky, if you know what I mean. Or regular habits. <laughs> noise on the premises. I can't make out what the inspectors say.